we know that it's a surveillance balloon, uh, and I'm not going to be able to be more specific than that. Uh, we New tonight, the Pentagon offering little details into the mysterious large balloon moving across the U.S. But new tonight, we spoke with a local legal and intelligence professor who provided a little bit of insight. The suspicious balloon has been drifting in the United States airspace since Wednesday. It was actually first spotted by residents out in Billings, Montana, and has been drifting east across the U.S. ever since. Pentagon officials say they are confident it was, in fact, a Chinese surveillance balloon, despite China's claims that it was a civilian device used for scientific research in meteorology. St. Mary's University law professor Jeffrey Atticon gives us his legal perspective. I said, no, it's, this is a spy balloon, um, and it's violated our territory, which is a violation of international law. It's a violation of our own sovereignty. Uh, it's about 60,000 feet in the air. We don't know exactly where it is right now, uh, but it's moving. The professor adds the best case scenario is if the U.S. can capture the balloon to take an up close look at its technology, as opposed to shooting it down and destroying all of the valuable intel it may have gathered.